Hello boys and girls, my name is Lauren and today I'm going to be doing a hair tutorial for you which is kind of funny because I don't exactly do my hair. Alright, so uh, usually for stage I don't do anything. Um, I know that's crazy but um, I don't have time and I find it very monotonous curling my hair. Um, I did it for maybe the first tour that we did, the Harmonize America tour. I curled my hair every day, um, and then the next tour we did, I curled my hair every day as well. And then I realized that I hated curling my hair, so I stopped curling my hair. And it's been that way ever since. <laughs> so basically what I do is, when it's really sweaty, like when I've, when I've gotten to a point where it's like way too greasy, which is usually like a day or two in, I'll wash it, and then that night I will blow dry it, and just like, not like, with a brush or anything, like I just literally blow dry it so that it's not wet anymore because I can't go to sleep with wet hair because I'll get sick. Um, and then I'll wake up in the morning and it'll look pretty much like this. So pretty much for stage, I will not be wearing this beanie. So I'm just gonna kind of go like this, flip it over, toss a little bit, and then make sure, I usually make sure that it's parted to the side because it looks more like stagey. But normal life, it's usually parted like, like that. But I'm gonna have it like this for stage because it just looks more grand. So I tried to do something the first day of tour because I thought, you know, this is a new tour. I'm a new person. I'm going to do my hair this time around. I washed it and then I put it into braids. Then sprayed some hairspray on them and then took them out for showtime and it just looked exactly like this. So I was like, you know what? I give up. I'm just gonna, it's gonna. Go all natural. I enjoy it. It's fun to flip around. I'm sleeping usually on a show day. And then I wake up for my makeup. Wake up for my makeup. And then I go back to sleep because I don't do anything to my hair. And then I'll wake up after Nirmani spent two hours on her hair and Dinah spent a couple on hers and Allie spent a couple on hers. Sometimes I'll help Allie with the back of her hair because she doesn't really ever get to it properly. So I pretty much don't don't do anything. It's pretty much a wake up and go sort of situation. This is my natural hair. But I'm gonna give you a little history on my hair because that's very interesting. So I started off as a youngin with black hair. I was born with it. I had a full head of hair. I was a hairy little baby. <laughs> um, it was black when I was born. Um, it's black now as well, but this is not natural. Um, it's glossed. Uh, yeah, I went through like a bunch of different hairstyles. I had like short hair when I was younger and bangs up until like I want to say kindergarten and then I grew it out and then when I was in fourth grade I had this incredible idea that I was going to cut my hair short and I went to this, the hair salon and they were cutting it and like I cut it like to right here and I was like let's go shorter and my hair was wet at the time so it looked great I kept cutting kept cutting and as you can see my hair is pretty wavy and when it's not this long and like weighed down it's just it just goes like that and it's like curlier. So in fourth grade I had really weird awkward side bangs that were just curly and that didn't didn't do the side bang thing at all that everyone had and then really awkwardly short hair. It was just so bad. I never and because of that I will never ever cut my hair again. See how long it is? It just stays like that because I'm very insecure about it. And then by sixth grade I finally got a good haircut. But no seventh grade I got a really good haircut and I had layers and it was like all luscious and stuff and everyone was like oh my god Hair. I was like, thanks, I finally like it too, this is really nice. And since then I just kind of don't do much to it. Alright guys, thank you so much for joining me. I'm so glad that you got to experience all the wonders that I do to my hair. For more episodes, make sure to subscribe to Awesomeness TV because it's pretty awesome.